Hello everyone, this is Professor Mamun. I am a professor of digital health at United International University and founder and director Advanced Intelligent Multidisciplinary Systems Lab and as well as founded CIMED Health which is a collaborative digital health platform transforming the healthcare landscape in Bangladesh. Today I would like to share with you my journey on digital health. So in Bangladesh, we are accommodating 2.5% of the world population in a small tiny 0.03% of the land. And you can see that in Bangladesh, huge number of people are suffering lack of access to healthcare. And most importantly, there is a huge burden in our secondary and tertiary healthcare systems. And you will, if you visit in some of the hospitals, you find all the hospitals are full of patient in the full of hospital beds as well as all the corridors and everywhere. Why it happened? It is due to the lack of health education, health awareness, as well as there is a lack of preventive and primary health care system. And with that, there is no referral systems that people can go and get the service on time and you will be surprised to know that to understand the scenario in 2015 we did a research that why the people are suffering in Bangladesh and we found very significant information from our research. I would like to mention some of the problems that is very critical to look into. First of all, in Bangladesh, due to non-communicable disease like hypertension, diabetes, and cancer, and so on. And what we found, 67%, that is two-thirds of the death happening in Bangladesh due to NCD. And due to that, there is a lot of premature death and reduces the productivity of the human capital. On the other hand, Due to no referral system, no health record, we could not identify that which disease need to be focused on. And another important thing is 74% of the out-of-pocket expenditure, which is the highest amount among all the developing countries. And there is no health protection or health insurance system in Bangladesh. Every year, more than 22% patient growing in hospitals. So this is due to the focus on secondary and tertiary care, lack focus in the primary, preventive, palliative and public health. To address these problems, we designed a technology oriented solutions, which is a CMAD health, which is a collaborative digital health platforms to transform the healthcare in landscape in Bangladesh by utilizing fourth industrial revolution technologies to make an impact in people's life, creating health inclusion through creating a health account for every citizen. If I say that CMAD provides a platform which unlocks individual potentials, builds a society which everyone has the opportunity to live healthy, fulfilling, creative and abundant life in rural and urban areas. What Cement is trying to create is efficient connects, efficiently connects the fragmented and disconnected healthcare systems today in Bangladesh, which actually empowers our patients, our healthcare providers with a lower cost and better health outcomes. And with that, we want to make a dream to have a comprehensive preventive, primary, secondary, tertiary and palliative health care. It's a journey of healthy living. So what we are trying to do here, we want to utilize artificial intelligence, Internet of Things and cloud technology. And most importantly, the smartphone, which is the biggest revolution of our era and which have a power of a computer, which gives the opportunity to connect our IoT device and AI-based clinical decision support system to do the risk assessment and connect them 
for the resources like a doctors, other healthcare providers, so that we can get timely intervention for our health concerns. If I summarize it, it's a life cycle of healthy living, prevention, diagnosis, and treatment, and most importantly, it helps us to preemptive health checkup, remote monitoring, home care, through that we can early identify our health risk like diabetes, cancers, stroke, heart attack, and we can make an intervention. And on top of that, based on the data, we can give preventive advices to get alert and aware so that we can reduce the all of a sudden risk of health concerns. And now you can imagine how can we achieve that. In Bangladesh, we have a 170 million population. That 170 million people, everyone need a health account. And with that, we need a regular health checkup through preventive and primary health care and access to doctors. You will be surprised to know that we don't have a, that much doctors, nurse and healthcare professionals. However, if we can efficiently utilize our limited resources through technology, then we can serve all the peoples. And in that platforms, what we are trying to do that can connect all the stakeholders like our government, our donors, our corporates, our factories, our pharmacies, our pharmaceutical companies, in future insurance company, and we can do the research. So with that, what I would like to say here, that this is a time that CIMED want to create a collaborative platform which can connect healthcare professionals, doctors, hospitals, pharmacies, dry tea, nutrition, and wellness services, and the future insurance to connect everyone in a single platform. So, how CMED Health Platform works? So think about it. You are staying at home, or you actually going to the pharmacy to buy a medications, or you working in an organization. Wherever you work, you can have a health account and a health assistant in the pharmacy, or at your doorsteps, or at your workplace. Create a health account and utilizes IoT-based smart medical devices to do their, your regular health checkups and all the data automatically connect to the smartphones and which actually transform into the transfer to the cloud and instantly you can know your health risk. What it will mean that you, sh you can know you what health concern you have. If you are healthy, you should be the happiest one in the world. If you have any concern, don't worry. The system will automatically connect to a physicians, doctors through the telemedicine to know what you need to do next. Based on the doctor consultations, doctor will advise you, you need to go for a test or you need to go to the hospitalization or next level of cares. In that way, you can actually getting the comprehensive referrals that covers your preventive care, your primary care, your secondary care, your diagnostics, and tertiary care, and so on. All the data is actually captured in the cloud into your health account, which helps artificial intelligence to future risk prediction in the future, in next 10 years or five years. Do you have any risk of stroke, any risk of heart attack, or so on? And that data, collectively from all the users will help risk prediction model which is robust for every individual as well as this data can be utilized to know the health concerns and risk or surveillance in the future where the which disease is are alarming is coming we can take intervention collectively Okay, now how are we going to serve the people in different segments? As I said, we are serving people in a factory where 
a health worker which could be paramedic which could be nurse actually providing service to every individual through creating digital health account providing a smart device based health vital check symptom check risk assessment using artificial intelligence based clinical decision support systems and based on that you getting the feedback and connect to the doctors through telemedicine to further intervention and after the doctor's intervention health worker will facilitate you that how you need to maintain your lifestyle or management and if needed the doctor will connect to for outpatient or inpatient service in your nearest hospitals or diagnostic services and in that way we can have a comprehensive ecosystems for our workers similarly we are doing the same thing for our creating health workers who actually taking the health kit go to the door steps and creating health account every member of the family in a household and doing the health checkup and preferring them for the doctors or for the services if needed similarly we are actually creating similar ecosystem in the pharmacy level because we know in bangladesh 65% cases people go to the pharmacy seek health care service however in pharmacy we are not getting qualified medical practices so therefore when you go to the pharmacy the pharma trained pharmacy owner will help you to create your health account and do your health checkup and connect for the telemedicine and in that way you can get the referral so overall what we get we get a comprehensive ecosystems and most importantly we can get preventive and primary health care through the qualified physicians and lastly i would like to say that we created a gp model practice where a union considered as a catchment area where every union accommodating around 7000 family more than 30000 members what it do it create health account for every citizen and giving the doorstep preventive and primary health care checkup and then connected to telemedicine unlimited for a family as well as there is a physician in the union level which is called gp center and household members can visit the gp center as many times as they needed to get the doctor consultation and healthy living advices you might be think of that this is very costly to cover that much ranges of services and unlimited telemedicine and doctor consultations you will be surprised to know that we developed the model which is a one dollar per family per month i repeat again it's a one dollar to cover a primary and preventive health care with doctor consultations for a family for a month which is a less than a coffee price in us or canada so together we can build these platforms for the people of bangladesh and it would be a model for universal health coverage achievement for all the developing countries beyond bangladesh with these platforms we can actually solve the problems of health inclusion and achieve universal health coverage in the developing world so if i summarize if i can utilize these platforms and create health account for 170 billion people which is a 2.5 percent of the world population we can easily make this population healthy productive and work towards achieving developed country dream and with that what it will give us it will give us a reduced out of pocket expenditure it will reduce the mortality rate of ncd and premature death as well as reduce the cost of healthcare services and most importantly data driven healthcare will give us huge opportunity now i would like to share you the very good success story that we made last 4 years and you will be happy to know that so far we served more than 3 million people in bangladesh and we have a dream 
to reach more than 100 million people in next 10 years, not only in Bangladesh, beyond Bangladesh. Finally, I would like to say that with the digital platform approach and the technology, we want to reach every citizen, create their health account, which is a health inclusion and helping people to live healthy, prosperous and productive life and together we can achieve it to make a world better for the next generation. Thank you.